Okay, the final mission. Here we are, let's do this, mother load. We gotta make sure that Marcus is protected. Sounds to me like good old asshole working for Bloom Dasha. Here he is. He's so pissed. Yep. It's gone on for too long. Oh, I heard you, Mary. The first motherfucking dozen times. If you did, we wouldn't be here, am I right? <laughs> Douchebag frustration. What's going on? What? Public enemy number one. Conspiracy? And did he darken my picture? Hey, Ray, can you scrub this shit? Yeah. It's not gonna be that easy this time. Looks like the douche has made you. <laughs> the douche, that's what I called him. Welcome to the club, amigo. Yeah, it's what he wanted all along, right? Set us up as the boogeyman terrorizing Silicon Valley. Dushan offers to protect him with the CTOS and the satellite backbone, and bam! Everybody falls right in line. Yeah, now Bloom has access to all that collected data, feeding the damn bellwether. Shit, it's like they got a wider reach than the NSA now. Yeah, I bet the NSA will be real interested in cozying up to them now. The NSA will encourage other corporations to keep spreading their legs for Bloom. Mm, I gotta do something. I can't stay here uh -uh. stuck. No way. That is exactly what Dushan wants. Besides, you've been doing a lot of the heavy lifting so far. Time to share a load before your back breaks. All right. All right, you guys take the field. I'll provide you logistics. Let's make this happen. Wow, and a mission where actually everyone is working together. It's hey, the first of the game. You gave me that look again. <laughs> Are we okay? Marcus is in serious trouble. Yeah, so let me help. I'm not the bad guy here, Satara. I get it, okay? But we don't lose each other here. That's primate. That's Silicon Valley. Are you guys cool over there? <laughs> yeah, we're cool. Something's gonna happen. They're gonna have a falling out. Watch. It's gonna fuck up the mission. Marcus. Whoa, what the hell? What, what, what am I looking at? Why am I looking at Sitar's ass? Uh, what is happening? Hello? <laughs> am I supposed to be watching this? Is, if, is this screwed up or something? What the fuck is going on? Uh, that's a lot of hungry teeth. <laughs> they all want to eat Satara. Meet Andrew Novak, Dushin's assistant. Oh, poor bastard. He's been stealing proprietary data for his new one true love, Mary Cat Skills. The CEO? Dumb bastard. I'm gonna hack his laptop, use his back door to get me inside Bloom's private cluster, and score the code we need. But to do that, I'm gonna need to stretch my legs first. Okay, I'm I'm actually playing as Sitara. How get to Desan's assistant's apartment? Yo, Marcus, play me something fresh. Kind of cool you get to play as the other characters. Uh, I went the wrong fucking way, didn't I? Yeah, I was supposed to go over oh. here. If only you could have played as these characters during the game. You know what? This is actually my main complaint with Mafia 3, too. Why the hell couldn't we switch between the characters? That would have been awesome. I'm going to need to find a way up if I'm going to disrupt the local CTOS router. Can't go on that now. Okay. Damn. Bloom really goes that extra mile to protect its own. Okay, I gotta get this one going. Here we go. This 
way. 60 seconds. Fuck, really? That's alright, I'll just re-rotate re re it, but... How the fuck do I get that? Oh, there we go. Alright. Aha! I did it! Nice! All in one run! Very nice! There you go. Easy peasy. She's not just an artist, she's also a hacker. And I'm in. If he finds out, I'll never work in tech again. That's the least of your problems, dear. Dushan will track down your family and get them fired, too. He's very high noon justice that way. Jesus! You're not helping! <laughs> Andrew, my door is always open. You know that. I don't plan on being an assistant forever, Mary. No, hon. Not as my assistant. You betrayed Duchenne. For you! And legal and HR will never let you come forward. Your lawsuit waiting to happen. Okay, then. She screwed over uh, the, the assistant. Code. Wrench, you're up. Oh, now we're to wrench, so we're gonna be jumping between them. That's kind of cool. All right, now I get it. That's why they're showing these screens. They're showing each person doing their own part. It's cool. I definitely like how they how they showed all the casts and different information about the different casts and the missions the casts have been involved in. You get to care about the characters, which is nice. Again, I just wish you could have played as them more. I don't understand why we couldn't. Backup data farm and nuking this sound. You'll get to break all the shit you want. That site's pulling in way too much power, hombre. And it's on Bloom's doorstep. Okay, so running gun. some muscles. Destroy the backup servers, or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about to fight. So much for backup. I'm still dead though. They give you a grenade launcher, but you still fucking suck and die almost instantly. <laughs> uh Let me guess, there's gonna be four million fucking enemies in this tiny little area. There'll be like 75 guys that'll spawn and come out of the doors. <laughs> of course. How does locating Bloom's backup data farm and nuking this sound? You'll get to break all the shit you want. That site's pulling in way too much power, Andre. It's on the store So go flex some muscles! Destroy the backup servers or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about. And still dead. Because once again, you saw what happened. They all spawned around me. A million little fucking guys spawn and just shoot from all directions. Ugh. Lame. It's funny because you can tell they want you to run in like Rambo, gung-ho, and just shoot everything. And you can't do it. You can't fucking do it. How does locating Bloom's backup data farm and nuking this sound? You'll get to break all the shit you want. That site's pulling in way too much power, Andre. It's on Bloom's doorstep. So go flex some muscles! Destroy the backup servers, or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about to fight. Dude, the auto aim still doesn't work. Oh! So, the computer's too stupid! To allow your character to shoot over the car in front of you. It's too stupid. Even though my target was obviously not on the car right there. Wow. This is the biggest shortcoming of the game is when you need to do third-person combat, right? The actual cover-based combat. 
or anything stealth Time indoors, it fucking falls apart completely. You'll get to break all the shit you want. That site's pulling in way too much power, hombre. And it's on Bloom's doorstep. So go flex some muscles! Destroy the backup servers or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about to wipe. Zero damage to the guys right there. There's a guy behind me! What the fuck? They spawned a fucking enemy behind me to shoot me in my ass. This is so fucking un Dude, how do you ruin the final mission of your game? Here's how. Oh my god. It's so lit. Whenever there's a part that excels, it excels highly. Whenever there's a part that fails, it fails terribly. Like, what the fuck? You're supposed to feel like you're overpowered here. You're supposed to, you can tell. So they're playing the music, they give you the fucking grenade launcher, and then you're a weak piece of shit surrounded by spawning enemies. Way too much power, hombre. And it's on Bloom's doorstep. So go flex some muscles. Destroy the backup servers, or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about to wipe. All he has is this, he doesn't have anything else. How the fuck could they have possibly seen me there? I can't do anything besides... Not what I wanted. I'm supposed to hack? It said destroy, not hack. Wow. Destroy the servers. I go, I shoot it with a grenade. No, it didn't work. You have to interact and hack it. What the fuck? That's not destroying then, morons. That's hacking. That's different. Oh my god. Why did they even give me the grenade launcher? I don't need it. I seriously don't fucking need it. <laughs> oh, what a waste. Bloom's backup data farm and nuking this sound. You'll get to break all the shit you want. That site's pulling in way too much power, hombre. And it's on Bloom's doorstep. So go flex some muscles. Destroy the backup servers or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about to wipe. Oh 
wow. <laughs> Great, we have a gang show up. Try to kill these people. Can't take cover. Dude, fuck this game. Are you fucking kidding me? These guys survived grenades. And then when I fired again, he kills himself. Fuck this. It's so poorly executed. God, this game is such a love and hate relationship. I enjoy the story, I enjoy the characters, I enjoy the hacking, I enjoy the atmosphere, I hate the gunplay, and I hate the stealth. It's terrible. It's fucking garbage. How does locating Bloom's backup data farm and nuking this sound? You'll get to break all the shit you want. That site's pulling in way too much power on Bright. And it's on Bloom's doorstep. So go flex some muscles! Destroy the backup servers, or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about to wipe. Take cover! Get spread out. He survived. Get out there. Start a sweep. Wow. So refined. I'm not alerted yet, but I gotta run. Took out all the power. Again, inadvertently. No one's even coming this way, so I'm good. Got 
hair. Ah, oh, look. A secret door. Does this room look small to you? Man, I'm not there. Yep, looks small to me too. Marcus Holloway's walking around right now, and we're spamming more. I can't print your me masks with your face on it fast enough for people. CTOS facial rec is going nuts trying to respond. It's safe for you to move around now. So that's it. Oh, so you don't even have to finish the mission with Ranch. It just ends. It just ends. He teleports out. Yes, of course. Wow.